guys if you know you know but if you don't my name is Tiffany and I am on a 40 pound weight loss journey and today is Monday um yesterday technically started my week but we're just gonna say you know start a work week it's Monday so today I haven't eaten anything and it is currently like after 6 p.m so today's gonna be OMAD day like already proud of myself okay we're at uh, we weighed in last week at 200.4, so the only way to go is down, okay, down to the one, so wish me luck, hopefully we make it there by Saturday, alright, see you later. Guys, okay, so it is Friday, I actually have not really vlogged um, a lot so far, but yeah, so I haven't seen you guys in a, a few days now, but I had to chime in say hey tell you guys how everything is going so far as you probably can tell i am in a different vehicle scenery i am in my husband's truck yes that does mean that the problem that the a lot dealership called themselves fixing came right back <laughs> and my truck is back in the shop but this time it was a whole lot shorter um, it's something that they should have checked originally, but you know how they do. They reset everything and then it just causes a huge inconvenience for you when it's not fixed. But um, right now, I am actually, okay, so I'm going to wrap the wrong side, but I am actually pulling up to a gas station because <laughs> I'm going <laughs> to, I'm going to surprise him by uh filling the truck up because i honestly like he been running me around like everywhere so he'll be surprised once he gets in here and his wife actually puts some gas in here but um i wanted to catch you guys up real quick like what's been going on what have i been doing this week like you know you already know about the truck wolves that's something totally different and out of anybody's control but the dealership but as far as like eating wise go, um, oh, and you guys can see that it's nice and rainy over where I am right now. I had to get off at a different exit off the freeway because it was backed up traffic, but I got off early enough today like where it doesn't really bother me. <laughs> so, but anyways, eating wise though, I've been having honestly smaller windows of eating this week and i feel a little bit lighter like they haven't even really been on purpose um but i've been eating like i've been fasting for about 20 hours a day i believe that one of the days was actually an omad day if you're not familiar with that that's just a um 23 and 1 method of intermittent fasting where you fast for 23 hours of the day and then you have a one hour eating window of that day so one of the days was uh you know was an omat day and omat literally just stands for one meal a day and the rest of the days were about like a 20 and 4 method so i was eating within like a four hour eating window um today I actually started eating like not right on time for my 12 o'clock, you know, eating window start open time, but about like around one I ate for the first time today. So this may be a little bit of a longer eating window today. It's Friday and um, I hope I said that already, but it's Friday and tomorrow is weigh in day. So I'm glad that I was like, I wasn't doing it on purpose, but I'm glad that I was eating in short and shorter eating windows because y'all already know, like I was like basically exactly 200 pounds, like 200, like 0.4, I believe. And I am hoping, <laughs> I am hoping and praying that tomorrow we are at least at 199.9, like at least like i know y'all expecting it i'm hopefully expecting it i don't know like i might have to shorten this window up like i need to have lunch at about 
three or four and be done for the day so I can make sure like I don't have no problems now as far as like working out up to this point um I have worked out um one time so far yeah I'm gonna work out today as long as I can get a virtual class um, I'm gonna work out today and depending on what time we pick my truck up or whatever he's supposed to be ready today it may even be ready already I just need to call to verify but um I believe that I'm gonna go ahead and do a virtual class today and I'll probably work out sometime sometime tomorrow maybe even tomorrow morning so the weather kind of sucks this weekend because I would have loved to like I technically had um plans with a friend to like go to uh one of the school like I don't know tracks or whatever and like run up and down the bleachers I've done that before I mean it ain't no joke but it works you know so um I really wanted to be able to do that but it's supposed to be like 30 degrees here tomorrow and windy and that'll be the high I think the low is like 19 or something like that so I don't know y'all that's that Michigan weather for you but I just wanted to check in with you guys let you know and I'm right here at Kroger like I wanted to make me a side salad yesterday to no lettuce like usually I know those things like I hate like when I have like my one of my staples like where I can pair with any meal like for me honestly a staple for me that I can pair with any meal is a side salad like whether I'm having like um I am following the ketogenic uh diet plan if you guys wasn't aware of that and y'all oh my goodness like I don't know how I almost forgot but we hit 30 subscribers today like I know for a lot of people they're like girl it's only 30 subscribers like but that is 30 whole humans like 30 individual people that actually decided to click that red subscribe button to subscribe to me like my life my weight loss journey and we are on a 40 pound weight loss journey and we are going to get there okay but that's like a big deal to me like I remember being stuck at eight subscribers and you know I'm just looking to still grow my channel and hopefully I can help somebody out there you guys definitely help me like um you know like I have like my day ones that actually like they I mean without fail they comment on every single video that I post and I really appreciate them like it's a few channels out there that you guys really absolutely need to um follow if you're not already and I'm sure so, a lot of you are already but if you're not some great smaller channels uh just to, to name a few right off the top would be tom's channel um his name is latchkey gen xer so that would be latchkey one word gen g-e-n and then xer x-e-r would be his channel and um check him out for sure gotta check miss uh betty j gathers out like have to and you also have to check out um shell which is bean bean feast 57 uh, i'm pretty sure that is what it is like bean feast 57 um if it's different i'll have it listed above but have to those are three staples you guys have to um check out if you're on a weight loss journey yourself like if nothing else like we all have different eating patterns but if nothing else we all do intermittent fasting and if you are on a weight loss journey and you're not doing intermittent fasting like what are you doing what what are you doing like intermittent fasting can enhance that's how i feel it can enhance any diet plan that you're on okay you can do whatever you want you know it can enhance it i personally do the ketogenic i'm on the ketogenic lifestyle because for me um although intermittent fasting can reduce your like um like some of your cravings and you know it can like have you like 
uh, eating less and all that sort of thing with intermittent fasting, for me, the ketogenic diet, and that's whether I'm intermittent fasting or not, like it really can keep me full. It's something about like my body burning on fat that for me it really keeps me full where i feel like satisfied and i'm not starving all the time like like you know like a lot of typical diets are um so for me whether i'm doing keto with intermittent fasting or not it really just like keeps me full and sometimes i have to remember to eat okay um that's that's, that's really when you're like really like deep in ketosis and all that stuff and it's a lot of videos out there that can kind of explain it a little bit more but you know yeah so anyway so um if nothing else inquire you know um put in intermittent fasting if you're not doing it already okay all right so i will check in with you guys probably a little bit later Maybe after I get the truck, maybe after I work out, but if nothing else, I'll at least see you guys tomorrow. So it'll be a lot faster for you than for me, but I'll see you then. it's acceptable like we are going to be through the roof like and that's what I am right now like 199.6 I cannot begin to tell you guys like how excited I am right now like <laughs> listen we didn't even lose I don't even know what it was like we didn't even lose a full pound this week we were at what like 199.6 um but I weighed in this week at 200.4. So like, I mean, almost a pound, but it's like 0.8 of a pound or whatever. But we'll take it. Like, I told you guys, like anything, I don't care if it's 199.999. Like, we're taking it. Like, we're taking it. So I'm excited. Let me try to see if I can show you guys kind of where I am. I got this t-shirt on my mom bought me. So you can't really tell in this shirt, but um, we're coming along. See my little stretch marks, y'all. I used to care about those, but I don't care about those anymore. Okay. They're part of life. Well, they're a part of my life. <laughs> Let me say that. I don't want to say they're a part of everybody's life, but this is what we're looking like. And I'm excited. Thank you guys for sticking with me through this journey so far. Um, how many more pounds do we have to go? Like, so we have at least about 24 more pounds to go. So I'm excited. It feel like, oh my goodness, like, I don't know why it feels like it took a long time for them 15 pounds. Like, this is work. Like, I don't know what it is, but I swear once I got into my 30s, and I'm now 34, I'll be 35 this year, which I know a lot of you already know, but if you don't, I'll be 35 this year. My plan is to be in the best shape of my life, but I only have like three more months to go. So exactly three months from yesterday, because my, my birthday is June 25th, but um, I, I don't know if we're going to get all the way into like the best shape of our life by then. But, like, you know, like, we're going to be damn near there. I tell you that. We'll be almost there. So, 
no complaints this week I mean, you know like I'm y'all already know like I'm went through the roof like mind blown like I was expecting it though um but that's the thing about weight loss when you like are consistently putting in the work like you start to see a consistent trend like yeah you might have a couple weeks where it's a little you know you might take a little back step or you might you know have a couple things going on in your life where you know like you have a little hiccup but as long as you get right back on on plan whatever your plan is like and you have something that's successful for you and it works for you like you will like the weight loss will come so we're not worried about that like i promise you like i'm just um uh, mentally like i have finally like gotten to the point where i realized i can't lose weight as fast as i once did and um like with that being said, like I know I have to be more consistent in order to actually lose the weight. And then I also have to be consistent on trying to maintain the weight. So um, that's what I'm doing, you know? Like normally I would have been giving up, not necessarily giving up all the way, but I kind of just started doing my own thing for a little bit. And then I'll try to get back in the groove of whatever like on track is um especially like you know i was what i was bad at was i would always like like let's say i first off i would cheat every single weekend like i'm having me a cheat meal week i mean a cheat day not a week but like a cheat day and then my cheat day always turned into a cheat weekend like and then I'd be like, well, I know I was good off Friday and then I ate bad Friday night, which kind of messed up my whole Friday, but I'll just start over on Monday. It was always a Monday, like always a Monday. Like the best thing I've I've made sure I've been consistent with this time is um, I'm not starting over on Monday. Like I'm not starting over on Monday. I thought I still had this tag on the shirt stuff. <laughs> I just thought about that and i just realized like it matches my hair the words yes i'm loving this thanks mom um so i'm i've been very consistent with hopping right back on track like um if you fall off track you have a bad day a bad weekend or something like that even a bad week hop right back on track like i'm not waiting till a monday i'm not waiting till nothing like i'm not i'm not doing none of that like if I have a special occasion and that special occasion is over, I might have one more day in there, but I'm hopping right back on track. Like I'm not going into a little trend where I'm eating kind of whatever I want for a few weeks or a couple months. And then it's like, dang, all the progress that you had achieved is like gone and, and it's hard to start back up again. No, when Tiffany fall off track now, I'm telling you, like it's a mental thing. I'm getting right back on there. Like, I'm not, like, if I, I didn't, but if I had eaten bad yesterday, I'd have been right back on there today. Like, for sure. Like, at the latest by tomorrow, um, you know, or even if it was like a weekend, like, I'm hopping right back on it. Like, I'm not letting time linger in between where now I'm, I'm gaining weight consistently, like for weeks at a time. So just keep in mind, you may not always lose the weight consistently as you would like, or week after week after week, because our, our bodies also fluctuate, especially as a woman, like whether you still have a menstrual cycle or you don't have a menstrual cycle anymore, like your body still goes through a phase where you, you you may not consistently lose weight or weigh exactly the same, you know? So, uh, yeah, I know. That was enough enough rambling for me, okay? Um, I did end up working out from home, as you guys can see. I, I hope I already inserted it. If not, then I'll be inserting it right now. I did a, a nice little workout today at home. I thought the gym had forgot about me again, but I guess I had made a mistake and signed up for the in-person class instead of the virtual class. So I'm like all on virtual, like waiting. Like I'm like, yep, they done forgot about me again. 
hear it, you know, I'm getting tired of them, but I guess it was me, so my apologies. Anyways, um, yeah, if you're not subscribed already, what are you waiting for? Like, go ahead, hit that subscribe button, uh, like, comment, share, you know, if this can help um, anybody else that you know, and un until next time, bye.